Shalom and welcome to Simchat Torah. This year is entitled "Is Yom Ha'atzma'ut Celebration a Biblical Mitzvah?" Is it a mitzvah for the Torah to celebrate Yom Ha'atzma'ut? Now I know many people are thinking, Danny Myers, we know right? you're pretty extreme with your Zionist views and your feeling towards the brachot that Hashem has given us for Jewish sovereignty, 1948. But that question is a bit too much. A biblical mitzvah to celebrate an event that happened 72 years ago. It sounds a bit crazy. And guess what? It is a crazy question. And my answer is even crazier. That according to Chetam so fair, yes, it's a biblical mitzvah to go ahead. You say, oh, that's really great. So going ahead and having a mangal in the forest in Israel somewhere is a biblical mitzvah. Now you've really gone off your rocker. No. Maybe you have, maybe you haven't. But that's a separate question. Yoridea Hatam Sofer Reish Lama Gimel. And I'm going to put an attachment to this YouTube. So anyone who receives the YouTube and watches the video, read the Tshuva. It's a long one. Just the last paragraph is all you need. And he says that celebrating a nais that Hashem has done for us is a biblical mitzvah. He says Hanukkah, biblical. Purim, biblical. What you do, you read the Megillah, you do this, Hanukkah, you like candles, you do this, that, that's rabbinic. But some act of celebration, thank you Hashem for saving us, me de oraita. And once you hold that, that's not only Hanukkah Purim, but you hold that there's other days that you can make your own Purims, which we have almost a hundred of them in our history. Purim Frankfurt, Purim very Purim Hai Adam. Once you hold that, you could and you should have these days of celebration. And once you apply that to Yom Matzma'ot, then doing something Yom Matzma'ot, thanking Hashem, having Sudat Mitzvah, according to Chasab Sofer, would be a biblical expression of Akarat Atov. Does everyone agree with this? Of course not. There's a Brichad there's other opinions. I'm mentioning the Chasab Sofer, who's obviously a God of Gedolim, so on a serious force to be reckoned with. We should continue to thank Hashem.